What's up you legends, welcome to Monaco. Now this is my new, no, I'm just joking, that isn't actually my new car. But today we are going to go down and do some sort of old school exploring of Monaco. I'm not entirely sure where we're going with this. I'm filming for the TV show documentary, which I spoke about in a vlog, a few vlogs back. They're getting some camera gear ready. I've got a friend, Will, with me back there. And we're taking the Panamera GTS. Look at my last video to know more about this car, the story behind this car. Taking it down to Monaco, we're gonna go car spotting. We're gonna meet up with a few friends and kind of improvise. So time to take this car down, see what we end up doing. We've driven around to see if we could find some cars. We've seen a few things, but I'm actually slightly disappointed that there isn't that much. We're now filming for, uh, for the documentary behind, but we've come to the McLaren dealership and we've got a few funky cars here. We've got the 720S, a 5 40C, I think, in the back over there. We've got a 570S Spider. Which is your favorite, Will? It's, I think I'm gonna get that one. Yeah, the 720? Bigger, bigger yeah. engine. I know, it's amazing. Oh. It's, it's so like we were walking around and looking at all the details of like here, the, um, the air vents which go in right there, or the lights. I mean, you guys know this, it's but simple, the light. I know, it's exactly, it's yes. like, it looks simple, but I'm sure underneath there is like so, so complex in the way they've designed it. I mean, look at this, the air flowing through there. The spec on this one is nice, discreet, but nothing sort of too crazy. I mean, gray, black interior. I think you'd need to do black wheels on a spec like this. Yeah, you want to get yeah. all black. Yeah, I think you, you just black the whole thing out. Look at that. I didn't, I didn't notice it's got pink rims. That's horrific. I love the little speaker thing on, on these 570s. It's very, very nice. Yeah, it's Bowers and Wilkins. Yeah, it's an expensive option to have that. Yeah, fair play. I mean, oh, what does it say here? Don't sit. Keep that in mind, Will. I can see you coming from a mile away. Try and guess how much this is, Will. Um, you no know idea, do you? I'll get for uh, 210. 210? Well, you're, it's your lucky day. You can save yourself almost 30 grand. 184,000 euros. There's the entry level. Well, <laughs> entry level. It's nice, though. It's got the carbon interior. Again, pretty simple spec, though. Silver with the black interior. S63 AMG. I love this, actually the interior color's really, really nice on this. It goes well with this chocolate leather so at the top. You me this car by saying there's a fridge there. I can there is a fridge, <laughs> there is a fridge. A few chocolate bars, yeah. Uh, that is the dream, imagine. Take your cold beer out. Oh when gosh. you open this up, you can take little tables out yeah. as well. Kind of like in an airplane, a few crisps. Bed. Exactly, you can lie down. Basically sleeping the whole way. Yeah, massage, Ideal. cooled seat, massage crisps and some beer yeah there's nothing else <laughs> and it also sounds amazing that is literally like a plasma screen yeah i know it's huge two screens all in that one little compartment right there they've got it on the new e-class as well i love the carbon <laughs> weight saving on an s-class daily driver goals right there absolutely it's nice in the matte gray as well yeah nice spec i like these wheels as well we can't actually go in this showroom but it's the well, god the reflections are matte anyways we've got an orange dawn there pretty bold a bit too yeah yeah, 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 and then the new Phantom 8, which is just, I am in love with that car. That would be, if I could get, any, well, I, mean, I think anyone, if they could get their, their dream daily, would get a Phantom 8. And then we've got, what else do we have? We've got Wraith, Dawn, and then another Wraith at the back. They seem to be very popular around here, Dawns and Wraiths, understandably so. Everyone seems to be on their lunch break, including Ferrari, which is a shame, because they've got an 812 super fast right there, which has to be one of my favorite cars in the world. Absolutely stunning. Another 488, a California T. Wow, yeah, this, 48, this 488 is actually a really nice spec with the, with the black splitter and then the black roof. I really like that. And then a little cheeky F12 in the background, which still look absolutely stunning. Still filming with Agiza. Have you, have you ever done any filming like this before? Sorry, yeah, I had a little bit of a... No, the, this is your first. Anyway. Yeah, well, no, we're kind of blues, exactly. It's also fun because we're, we're speaking in English, but then we, as soon as we're filming, we've got to do it in French. We've got to do it in French so over the, there. It's the most bilingual videos I've ever done. I know, I know. So we're switching languages every two seconds. Yeah. We basically do what we're going to do for the vlog, and then they ask us to do it again in French. Um, you do that naturally. Right, exactly same, but in French. But in French, and we're like, right, okay, let me think, what did we do? Oh, oh, we've got a Rolls on the way. That's gorgeous, actually, in white. Car spotting, boom, Rolls Royce Dawn, gorgeous. It is literally the Rolls Royce day today. Parked up and joined up with a friend, Mumu, there, who's being filmed right now, and his Bentley Bentayga, gorgeous inside. The details, I mean, these, like, air vent things are just so, so cool, and they all feel so quality. So much space as well. And the leather is just the highest grade of leather. Beautiful stitching, diamond stitching on the side of the seats there. Heated, cooled massage seats, absolutely gorgeous. So it's cool to see him rocking around in this. He's usually got a Liberty Walk 458, but this is the new uh, daily. Absolutely gorgeous. He's also 
painted the calipers in orange. Let me know what you think. I actually think it looks really cool. Uh, and then we've got the full chrome front grille. Usually there's a sort of strip which goes down here, which he's removed in order to have it all chrome, which I think looks very nice. A few cool cars there on the sign. We're driving back up in the Panamera. We've been cruising around all day, and that's the beautiful thing. I mean, I spoke about it in the last video, that this car is so comfortable and you can just cruise with it. And then when you want it to, it's so sport and brutal and makes that insane naturally aspirated V8 noise. I'm trying to do more videos and keeping them fairly short, so it's not gonna to be too, too long. Listen to this here. This should sound quite nice. We're now heading back up to the house. I'm probably gonna take a dip in the pool because it is so warm here in Monaco. I'm not used to this anymore. I think the next video is gonna be a pretty cool convoy, so stay tuned for that. It will be coming pretty soon. The first time I'll ever see a Lamborghini Urus. So I'm excited for that. I wouldn't be back in France if I didn't get some baguettes. So that's the first stop of today, isn't it? Yes. Try it out, is it good? Oh, some French baguette. It's French, it's so good. It's so good. That's the day there, it's been awesome. We're gonna end it here a bit shorter than usual, but thank you for watching. Remember to subscribe if you haven't already. I'm boiling hot, so I'm gonna get in the pool. Cheers guys, bye bye. <laughs> hey. Let's go. Back.